And unless you really know what you're doing, don't try this at home. <laughs> hey, everybody. Hey, guys. Welcome back to our channel. Thank you all for checking out this video. We hope you guys enjoy it. Good morning, everybody. Good morning, guys. Today's Friday. We got a half a day with the kids at school today. We got a Tahoe to check on, and we got a bunch of things that I was supposed to be doing this week that have slowly crept into Friday. So we'll see how Friday goes. We're heading to the schools right now to drop these dudes off. We came back to the house real quick. We're trying to look for a folder. It's got all the uh, important papers, CIBs and birth certificates and whatnot. We were in the process of moving last year and uh, we haven't really needed it. We kind of need it now. So we're looking for it. We're going to roll it out here in a bit. We're taking a break and Mama Bear warmed up some of the stew from last night for lunch or breakfast for brunch. So I'm having some nishiji with fry bread for breakfast. I am so glad Mama Bear checked where I checked. <laughs> We've been here for a bit. We're actually supposed to be checking at Tahoe right now. The time that I told the guy, it's past that time now. But I messaged him again. I told him we're going to be a little bit later than we had originally planned. And um, I guess when I looked through... <laughs> all my drawers that I have all the important papers and stuff in I didn't see a single green folder in there and um, we were looking for like an hour through my car and my other car and mama's car and checked over in the um, the spot we call the beehive it's a little camper that we have I use it for my art stuff usually I tattoo out of there or we do we just our art stuff down there and it's a cool little spot um, me and mama bear lived out of it for like a little over a month when we were moving the trailers because we moved the old one out and then we got the ready to put the new one in and the boys stayed up at the house with their papa they have their own room and stuff everything up there um, so they were staying up there and then we stayed in the that little camper which was kind of cool. It was like cozy, I guess. <laughs> a little bit of uh, tight confines for living in it, but it's a nice spot where we go hang out out there and do art. Like, it's mainly just um, tattoos and nails, but Mama Bear does that here now because it's winter time and it's kind of cold out there. But we checked over there and we checked in the other spots where everything is stored. And when I checked them in the room, I definitely didn't see, I was thinking to myself, like, where did I see the screen folder? Where did I see the screen folder? So me and Mama sat down after like an hour. And um, that's when we're eating. And we talked about it. It was in a white folder. Well, <laughs> so did the green folder. No. It was in a green folder. But the green folder was, <clears throat> I guess, put into a white folder when we left it in the truck. So... <laughs> This white folder has been in my drawer with the important papers for a long time, but it has her dad's name on it. So I thought it was the land papers when he signed over all the land and everything to Pam and the boys. And uh, that's been in my, my drawer for a bit. I didn't know that the green folder was inside a white folder and that's, <laughs> that was the yeah. So luckily mama um, got some food. She had some fried bread and then uh, her brain started working. And she checked where I checked, and then she found it. <laughs> yeah, that's usually how it goes. We have left the house again. <laughs> We're going to go head in and check this truck real quick. And I still got to go do this taco trailer too. So we've got a few things to do, and we've got to pick up the boys too. It's been a busy morning. I had a long morning. <laughs> Sometimes we have long mornings, and it's not anything that we do. No. It's. Well, lucky you had a long morning with breakfast. Usually it's a long morning with no breakfast or no time to do anything else but just. That is true. Be busy. <laughs> so we're gonna go check this truck now. We have arrived at the Tahoe, so we're gonna, I'm gonna hop out and check this out real quick. Well guys, we checked out the Tahoe, kind of, not really. Um, I didn't know the Tahoe was 
like the, so the jack that I have in here is for like cars and SUVs like this one. So if the Tahoe was not lifted, it would have definitely lifted off the ground. But because it has bigger wheels and tires on it, the jack lifted the Tahoe, but there was still enough of the tire contacting the ground that I couldn't spin it freely. And I can't really tell. So when we're rolling, when I'm in the truck and we're moving, it sounds like there's either... Um, I, at first, I thought it was a bad CV or a bad bearing or something with the brakes. And it's the front passenger side. So when we stopped, I crawled under there and I noticed that there's, it doesn't look like there's anything wrong with the CV really. So it's either the bearing or the brakes. And the bearing didn't look like there was anything wrong with it because when I moved the tire, it moved side to side, but that was the steering. And um, I was moving the top of the tire in and out. It wasn't moving too much. So uh, I got to get the tire off. So I gotta get the tire off and see if there's any metal on metal contact with the brake rotor on the inside, on the passenger side front. But I gotta come back into town with the bigger jack and the jack stand. So I had the jack under there and I put it in the spot where it was gonna get more clearance. But right when I got to the last, like right when it came off the ground, the the weight was on it and shifted a little bit on the jack, so it slid on the control arm and the the tire hit the ground again so I don't want to be under there when it does that uh oh we don't know where H&R block is so we're going to hit up that truck again later on this afternoon when we come back in with the jack and all the right equipment for it right now we're going to go uh, meet Pam's mom and dad real quick we just got to see them real fast about it. What happened there? We did another test. We have Jackson. I think we're going to stop at the dollar store. And then we're going to head over to the mid school and pick these dudes up. Okay. Too bad we have no money for pizza, Mama. Uh -huh. Pizza sounds so good right now. Pizza sounds good. Actually, I would take a calzone from Fatali's. Mm. Mm. After a quick stop at the dollar store, <laughs> we have made it to the mid school. So we're going to sit here and play the waiting game. I found them. We picked up all the boys, we hit up Lowe's, and we are meeting Pam's mom again. And uh, we're at Pizza Hut North. We changed our mind. The boys want big cheese, the pizza. <laughs> okay, big cheese it is. Got some wings too while we were at it. After we left Big Cheese on the north side, we came down to the east side. We're gonna come on over here to Walgreens for a couple of things first, and then we're gonna go follow Pam's mom to Darius's house. We're gonna drop the car off there. He wants us to come back in later on this evening to check his soup rates, making a weird noise, and then we're gonna go back home. Oh, look at that truck. That's how I used to ride around. <laughs> Didn't care what color my truck was or how many colors it was, I just drove it. <laughs> Scraped it on everything like that one. We dropped the car off at Darius's house, so we are a full ride. We are heading back to the house right now. Was that a long day today? Yeah. So it was a long, short day today.
thought the roads were going to be bad, but it seemed like Mama Bear didn't have too much of a problem with it. <laughs> no, it's muddy, but... It's muddy right here. Oh, just oh, worse. Oh, snap! This is worse than the whole road of, huh? Yeah. We're almost home. Good morning, everybody. I don't know what we're going to do today. Today's Saturday, but I'm going to go outside and go through my tools and see what we got to do take out of the truck before today. I don't know if we're going to do anything as far as like going to the flea market and stuff. But I got to go try to find Buddy. He was chasing some female dog up the hill and he's gone. Mama Bear is like super worried about him. She's like worried really bad. So. Well. Oh, the road looks pretty bad. Yeah. It's the middle of the day now. Okay. We're heading to town finally. We had a couple of things that I wanted to do today, but none of them got done. One of them was at the house, <laughs> but it was way too muddy in the yard. And the other one was um, the taco trailer, but I can't seem to get a hold of where the taco trailer is right now. So I don't know if they're using the fryer that I got to move to put holes in the wall or not. And then we've got um, a message about a Kia that needs a new um, power generator for the hybrid system in it, um, which normally would be an alternator, or what normally would be an alternator on most vehicles. So we hit them back up. Uh, we haven't heard anything back yet. So we're gonna head to town real quick. We gotta go run to the store and do a couple of things, pick up a couple of things. And I gotta um, look for the missionaries tonight. So. Oh yeah, the missionaries. They text earlier, asked if they could come over this evening for dinner. And um, well, they asked if they could come over. We told them it was cool. And they asked if it was alright if they had dinner here. And we told them it's always alright if they have dinner with us. So we're gonna go cruise to town, pick up a couple more pork chops. We so we are heading to town right now. Jackson is with grandma and his papa already. They're in town and uh, Draven and Michael don't want to go anywhere so they're home. Baseball started today. <laughs> First spring training game is today and uh, the Rockies were playing the D-backs. It was at 1.10 our time, which is usually the, the normal time for starting. But it's the first spring training game today, and the Rockies were ahead really early, 4-1. to one. But it's the fifth inning now, and the D-backs are catching up slowly. So, baseball season has started. And even though it brings me a certain amount of stress, and it's got nothing to really do with me, and I'm not ever going to make a difference in the team, but uh, it also brings a strange comfort knowing that every, every month for the next nine or so months, there's just going to be baseball. I don't know if the Rockies will go anywhere near the postseason this year, but every year I hope so. And uh, every year I get let down and I realize that uh, the Monforts, the owners of the Rockies, don't really care about winning. They just, they sell tickets whether they win or lose, so it doesn't matter to them. Seems like it matters way more to the fans than it does to the owners. <laughs> yeah. Hopefully we get to go to the game. I want to go to a few games this year, but for sure we're going to, we need to at least go to one. And we'll take all of you guys with us. That's going to be cool. I love Coors Field. I love Denver. Mama Bear, your hair looks awesome today. Thanks, honey. Looks awesome every day. I like that it's different. It's not the same hairstyle every day. Mama Bear does her hair so many different ways, I had to start tying my tie in different ways whenever I would get ready. <laughs> we made a quick stop here at Lowe's, picked up some more pork chops and some rice. Yeah.
are making one stop for gas and monsters. Man, look at this GTO. We're cruising up the road, and uh, all the water that runs from back this way, the water runs under the ground right into here, and it creates these weird tunnels right here. So it goes down right there, and then you can see these other little tiny holes. It starts creeping further and further that way until it gets to the ditch, but there's a lot of like sinkholes. The other side is worse. Not a whole lot of water in it today, but it's, it's there. This is on the side of that ditch. And those um, areas where the water is running, they actually come out way down the ditch down here. Kind of crazy. crazy. It is later on in the day, and uh, I am changing the propane bottle right now. But we've been back at the house for a bit, and Buddy came back. So that's a good thing, but it looks like he got into a fight somewhere. So I'm not sure what's going on with that, but Buddy's back and we um, had to put him inside. So he's not allowed outside anymore. He's been gone for like three days and it worried Mama Bear quite a bit. Also, um, Pam's parents came back up here to the house and that means Jackson's back. So he's inside and Mama Bear's inside. Her mom's in there and they're working on dinner, I think. What are they doing? Well, they're working on dinner for sure. I don't remember what's going on in there, but I've been out here for a little bit. In a little while, when I'm dead out here, I'm going to run inside and then we'll see what's going on in there. What are you doing, baby? Sweeping in here. Oh. <laughs> Our guests for the evening have showed up. So, Mama Bear is done with dinner right now. And what do you got, Mama Bear? What do you got? Some chops and some rice. Oh, look at this. Good morning, everybody. Good morning, guys. I don't know if you could even see, but there are some butterflies in here. I think once I get a top coat on, then you'll be able to see. Right now, it's still... I just finished filing them. It is Sunday morning, and we're going to get ready to go to church here in a bit. Um... Papa and Grandma already came down and took off, so the boys are also here. We're all going to be going to church, and we'll see what else Sunday entails. Going with the Trinity knot today. You look pretty today. Thank you. <laughs> So the boys are ready, we are ready, we're going to head out now, but look what is going on out here. You ready for church, bro? Yeah. Yeah. Heading to church right now, snowing still, seems like none of it is sticking to the road yet though. Nice view out that side too, huh? Yeah. We have made it to church. <laughs> we are heading in. We are done with church now. We just left from the church, so we're done with our sacrament meeting. And we were going to head over to meet Pam's parents, but I'm going to hop off at the mall. Um, our bro Dom is at the mall waiting. He just came in from Sheep Springs, and he's got a load of wood for us. So. I'm going to have to go head back to the house with him and see if his little two-wheel drive truck will make it up to our road. And then uh, we're going to unload the wood, and then that's my day, I guess. So I'm going to hop off in a bit. These guys are going to go find Pam's mom before she heads back out of town, back to Albuquerque. Riding back to the house right now. We are just getting to the west side of Gallup. I am with my really good friend, my brother Dom. What's going on? He's really cool. He's hooking up some wood. We're gonna go um, do some work for it too, some back and forth on it, but we really need some wood at my father-in-law's uh, side of the yard. So uh, he is bringing a whole load for us. So we are grateful. Thank you, Dom. No problem. This guy always, always got us. Out. So we're gonna make one quick stop for a monster, of course, and then we're gonna head home. Uh, Pam and the boys are meeting with her parents right now. So they're gonna go do 
whatever they're going to do today. All right, everybody. I made it back to the house. I've got the wood unloaded, so I was supposed to not do it in this one. <laughs> in my suit. But I've got the wood unloaded, so i got to go out there and I'm going to probably chop it up before Pam and her parents get back. Because if her dad sees that pile out there, he's going to start chopping it himself. So I'm going to go chop it before he does. All right, guys. The snow is starting to pick up just a little bit. So, I definitely have to get this covered. <laughs> I have to get this chopped and covered. You can't even see the Twin Buttes anymore. Normally, that's where you'd see the Twin Buttes. It's snowing kind of crazy again. And the cat is outside. Well, I guess I better get started on this, huh? <laughs> Look, two cats. There's Misty, or Mr., and Larry. <laughs> Here's the pile. I'm going to chop some of this real quick and then cover the rest of it, I guess. Getting a little chilly. This isn't the biggest pile in the world, but it'll get through the night. And it was bigger than the pile that was there when I showed up. I'm acting like I never chopped wood before. It's been a while. <laughs> I'm gonna pile all this up on the porch so it doesn't get snowed on. Just kind of went right by. Now you can see the Twin Buttes. Through the tree, of course. Bro, you gonna carry some in? <laughs> I need some new gloves. It's hash browns, beans, lettuce, cheese, and green chili. They still got my order wrong. But it sounds good. <laughs> Mama came back and she brought some Blake's. She ordered a burrito. But every time Mama orders a burrito, unless I go in there and order it, they just do it wrong. I don't know why. I don't know. <laughs> I checked everybody's hamburgers before we left to make sure it was right. I didn't check mine. Mama bear. Usual. That's the usual. Now we know. Daddy needs to go so he can check your burrito. Yeah. Watching baseball highlights Jackson. while we're eating. Yeah. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. Good morning, guys. We are starting our day. We are starting here with the baby. So we're going to send him to class. And then we're going to go across and do our normal stuff. Drop these other dudes off. And then we're going to go about our day and see if we got a full day today. Later, D. Have a good day today, son. Yeah. Love you. Love you. We're at the mid school. Draven's hopping off right now. Michael's going to get off here in a second. We've got the little dudes dropped off. Now to see what we're going to get into today. Hello again, everybody. Mm -hmm. I know in the video it is really quick, but for us, during the day, it is a little bit later. Um, after we dropped the kids off, we went by... Warren's work uh, from Yazi Family Vlogs and I was talking with him for a bit just catching up on the weekend and seeing what we're going to do we got some tattoos this week with him and we're going to go um, eat some acorn dumplings tomorrow with with Warren and Sue she's going to make us some so it's going to wow. be it's going to be our first time trying it and it's going to be awesome <laughs> so uh, we were over there at Warren's for a bit and then we went over to her nephew Darius's house because he's got that really nice super that we're always having on the channel he said it's making a terrible screeching sound so i'm gonna go check that but we showed up over there and um they're still doing their morning routine and uh his lady is getting ready for work so she's gonna roll out and we left from there 
we went over to the taco trailer to our bro Dylan's and I just started on that. I went in real quick, got a quick measurement. Um, I told him what I was going to get, told him I'd be right back. So we took off and um, we were going to go to Home Depot, but Ace Hardware is way closer. It's right down the street. <laughs> yeah. So we're going to go in right here to Gallup Lumber or Ace Hardware and we're going to see if we can find the necessary nuts, bolts and washers. And then we're going to head back and the drill bit that I need, I broke mine and I don't really want to buy a new one. So I'm going to use his. <laughs> So we're gonna go inside and um, let's go check out Ace Hardware. We came to get some of these and washes for it, of course. Uh, no, it's All right, you guys, we've got these put together. We've got the wall on the trailer. I'm gonna drill this hole. I'm gonna run this from the outside. I'm going to put this washer on it so it doesn't pull it in. Then we're going to use this little rubber grommet. Put this on here so the water doesn't leak through the trailer when it's raining. And then we're going to put this through the wall and then through the fryer. And then we're going to put this washer on it. And then we've got a nylon lock nut so we won't be having to tighten this every week. <laughs> so this, we've got two sets of these and uh, we're going to go pay for them right now. Now we're going to go head back over there and put these in. All right, guys, this is the problem we have right here. This hole right here, um, there's a screw that goes into the wall. Same with this side. But as he's driving and this thing's moving around, this starts coming away from the wall and it's ripped the screws out of the wall on both spots. We put bigger screws in, did the same thing. So now we're going to drill a hole through it and we're going to fix it like that. I've got the fryer moved out of the way. And with these holes already here, I just took a screwdriver. I put it in here. Give it a little tap, both sides. So now, if we look here, you can see right here is one, and right here is one. So that's where I'll drill the holes, and then we're gonna mount this thing. The trusty Milwaukee, back <laughs> my buddy Greg. We've seen Greg this morning too, that all sips. Seems like he's doing all right. And unless you really know what you're doing, don't try to stay home. <laughs> See if we need to make this hole any bigger. We're gonna use a metal washer and a little rubber grommet so it doesn't seep water in. And go in. Maybe a little bit bigger. Nice. Awesome. Awesome. And as you can see in here, it definitely does poke through. Okay. Hey, Roscoe. Now we've got it started through here. So we've got the washer on here, and Mama Bear showed you guys outside what it looks like. So we're going to do that to this side as well, and then we'll secure everything tight. We got done with the taco trailer. We have secured the fryer and it is not going to have any problems ever again. No. I think we're going to get some munch real quick and then uh, we're going to go check out this Supra again because we stopped by there a while ago. Yeah. But uh -huh. We're going to go back over there. I told them we'll be back in like an hour or so. That was a nice little quick job. Mama Bear said she's going to buy me a breakfast burrito. Yay. So we're over here at Blake's on the south side. <laughs> we have ordered. Now we are going to wait in the truck. Yeah, I just got a regular old burrito. I just got hash browns, cheese, and green chili on my burrito. Mine is hash browns, eggs, bacon, sausage, red chili, and cheese. <laughs> Four. Four? What is that? The one you got. Thank you, Mama Bear. This one says red. Bam! Burrito! After a quick stop at Lowe's West, we are heading down to the school to pick up Jax. After we left from Blake's, we went to go check out that Toyota Supra. 
But before we can get to it, Pam's nephew um, <laughs> called a tow truck and said he's gonna go take it over to Amigos. So I went through a couple of questions with him and uh, I determined that it might just be the brake pads, but he's gonna go take it in and see what it is. We're gonna go pick up Jackson now. We ended up not really getting a whole lot of stuff done today. On the computer, I got a lot of stuff done today, but not like work-wise, so. Also, the alternator that you were supposed to replace called and said that the car was working Oh yeah. Fine. The alternator that we were gonna replace in the Kia, I got a hold of them and they said that their vehicle is running fine and they didn't know what had happened to it. So, we're not gonna do that one either. We're gonna get the baby. <laughs> We find ourselves over here again at the truck stop. <laughs> Jackson wanted a hot dog. We made one quick stop after the hot dog stop. <laughs> I just stopped by to see my cousin Randy real quick. And now we are getting to the mid school. Mama Bear, yeah. what's with all this traffic? <laughs> Normally we would come right over here after the elementary school, so now we're catching all the parents that stop by the dollar store and the gas station and come over here. <laughs> Our day in town is coming to an end. We didn't vlog a whole lot today, but that's because I didn't do a whole lot today. I spent a lot of time uh, on the laptop and I was reading a lot of stuff. Uh, I was doing a lot of research. So. Mama's all researched out. Yeah, I am. <laughs> the first one is in. Well, he's getting in. What's up, Michael? Hey. How was school today, son? It was good. Papa's attempted to fix the road. Looks like this afternoon. So half of it is nice and flat. <laughs> The other half still looks like a mess, and it's like this all the way up and down the road. <laughs> Glad your dad's done that. I know, right? Mm, those potatoes look good, baby. Mm -hmm. This is what's <laughs> for dinner tonight. And it does look like a duck, but it is not. Or is it a swan, Mama? Swan. This looks good. freaking amazing. Nice. Steak looks delicious. Well, guys, that's it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. And like always, thanks for all the love and support. We truly appreciate it. We love it, actually. Y'all yep. <laughs> have a wonderful rest of your day. We'll see you guys later. Y'all stay safe. Y'all stay warm. <laughs>